Look at these! <laughs> These are so pretty. Christmas pudding wine, but I'm obsessed. Guys, look at this. There she goes. So I think it is Anderson. I feel like this whole vlog is just gonna be me going. <gasps> Hi guys, welcome back to another video of mine. Today's video is actually going to be a really, really exciting one. I am actually on my way to a garden centre to have some lunch with a friend to look at all of their Christmas decorations. So it's actually going to be one of the first festive and really Christmassy videos on my channel this year, which I am really happy about. I love Christmas, so if you like vlogs, there will be a lot of vlogs coming on the channel over the next month and a bit. So you guys might think this is way too early to be starting any kind of Christmas festivities, but it's the 12th of November today and I'm even contemplating putting up my tree next week just because I love Christmas, why the hell not? Feel like today is gonna be the perfect location to go and get us in a really festive mood, which I'm so excited about. I've actually never been to this garden center that I'm actually going to today, which is called Haskins. Apparently it's a really, really good one. Um, it's about a 40 minute drive from my house and I'm actually meeting one of my friends there who is so, so, so heavy heavily pregnant. Um, she's due to give birth next week. She could give birth while we're eating a pizza. I hope that doesn't happen because I won't know what to do, but I am so excited to see her. Obviously, she's at the last few weeks now. If I do pick up anything today from the garden centre or home centre, I'll do like a mini little haul later on in this vlog. So yeah, that is the plan today, guys. Does anybody else get paranoid about like that they've left the plugs on? I sometimes get in the car, start the engine, go down the road, and then I'm like, oh god, did I turn the straighteners off? Uh, can you sit, please? Good girl. See you then. And she always likes to take it away because for some reason I think she thinks someone's going to take it, which has never happened before. It's actually raining outside, so I've decided to put my um, shacket on, my big old shacket. I wanted to ask you guys a question, actually. For those of you that are late 20s or like early 30s, do you feel like you question your previous wardrobe? Because I feel like when I hit 30, you kind of question some of the stuff in your wardrobe and you're like, well, I can't be wearing that anymore because I'm in my 30s. Like, I still feel like 20, 20, Four, twenty-five. I don't feel any older, so I totally get it's an old person saying when people say, God, I don't feel any older than 20, but now I totally get it. I've gone with this. Shacket, black jeans, biker boots, it's a safe option, and a black roll neck. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm gonna end up buying stuff. Yeah, you will. That's why, but it's one of the most expensive ones. Oh, is it really pricey? Thing. But it's like <gasps> the best one to like look at. Guys, look at <laughs> this! <gasps> Law! I know! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so Three excited. Candles. <laughs> Three in a little tear. I actually need some baubles, but if they're glass, I can't. I don't think they Plastic, maybe? Look at this! Shall we get food first and then we'll have a look around? Cream. Just waiting for our pizza, guys, but look what Laura got. <laughs> oh, look, and I ate mine already. <laughs> Before. I know. That looks so good. Mm. What was it called? A breast? Paris breast. Paris breast. There she goes. Mm. Oh, Laura, you didn't even take a big bite then. Crack an aniseed flavour. Aniseed? Do you not like it? Mm, I thought it was just plain cream. Oh no, do you not like it? It did say just cream. Have a lick of the cream. Tell me what flavour that is. <laughs> I can't work out what flavouring that is. Oh, I know what you mean. No, I think it is aniseed. It's not like a hazelnut, is it? It's like a... Almost tastes like medicine. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? It's annoying. We're just waiting for our little pizzas. They'll buzz on here. There's a homeware area, a clothing area. I would buy some bits. I would love to, but it's very expensive for there. What bubble? Oh, the white one. Yeah, that was nice to be fair. Again, still that was a fiver. Maybe get like three. <gasps> pizza's ready. Pizza's ready. <laughs> Panic. So I've got a margarita. How is it, Law? So good. Divine. Divine. 
I want to get some maybe stuff for hot chocolates. Christmas pudding wine. Babe, look at the size of those marshmallows. Cut them for a hot chocolate. They'd be amazing. Oh, pastely ones. Oh, what is that? A cold turkey? Oh, it's ale. Four for ten. That's not actually that bad. Oh, Christmas gin. <gasps> Oh, 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 now we're Elder talking. Look at these guys. <laughs> That's literally me getting out of bed. Oh, babe, that top one, what, Trudy? <laughs> <laughs> Look at these. These are so pretty. I really like this. I know, I did. How much is that? Four ninety nine. Five pound for one ball ball is a bit much. Laura, I'm obsessed. <gasps> This whole vlog's just gonna be me going. <gasps> oh, that's a nice one. Oh, that's tasty. What kind of colour do you have now then? Is it more like gold? It's more kind of like these, like rose gold. Yeah, this is what mine's kind of like. I'd say this is my theme. Rose goldy and wood. And wood, yeah, I like a bit of wood. Guys, look at this. <laughs> Next week. I can't believe Eight it. Days to go. Eight. Eight. Are you scared? Yes. Babe, it's, going to fit it's your that. last week of not being a mum. I mean, you are technically a mum, <laughs> but you've not met them yet. Isn't that weird? You it carry them weird. for nine months. I could have another vagina or another William, and I don't know which one. <laughs> Honestly, it's like a festive dream in here. I can't believe that. I didn't even know. I've never been. Law! There's okay. even more. Oh, law. Oh my God, do you want that from me for Christmas? How much is it? <laughs> Fizzy strawberries. How much are they? Eight pounds. Guys, guess how much these are, right? Got lovely little like dairy milk bars with messages on. Really nice. Five pounds. Before you finish that sentence. <laughs> yeah, it's five pounds. <laughs> okay, should we do Christmas cards and candles? Sniffy sniff. What does it smell like? Gingerbread. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> 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 Not my nose. You didn't resist, you made that too easy. <laughs> oh, these are really cute. How much are these? Doesn't say. They're free. Oh, for God's sake. Yeah. my mum would say. It's free, that one. <laughs> so we've got some little Christmas cards. That one is my favourite. That, that smells delicious. incredible. Oh, oh Christmas spice. Like that one. Let's have a sniff. Oh, that yeah. One, that oh, one's that one's a bit. It smells a bit minty. Yeah. What's this? Christmas spice. Anything, anything like <gasps> Oh. <laughs> See, I love a raspberry. I love a raspberry. Oh yeah, I do like that. I feel like that's a very summery scent though, isn't it? Frosty snowman. Oh, here he is. Oh, what a warm cashmere smell like. <laughs> oh, oh. Too fresh for me. Yeah, like your grandma's house. <laughs> but are they the ones that make the... Uh, yeah, like the long noise. They, but don't they clap, crack? They make noise. Do they? Yeah. They make the sound of a fireplace. I didn't know that. Because Aldi were doing cheap versions of this for like one of them for like two pounds. They say, yeah, they sell them in B and M. I've never been to B and M. Oh, babe, you've never been to B and M. How are we friends? A chocolate log with a little smiley face. Oh my god. <laughs> little legs. I'm in love with the mince pie. To be honest, look at him. Oh no, look at him. He's so cute. It's ready to party. <laughs> Christmas day. Fabulous. I quite like it. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yep. It. Bits, a bit, a bit, bit of bling. So guys, Laura doesn't know what she's having yet, who's in there. <laughs> but this is her girl's name. And we literally just saw this and we were like, oh, is it a sign? And we can't find the boy name. And we can't find the boy name on here. So she's like, should I buy it? Should I not? Mama, oh, I don't you, know. Are you or not? Oh, don't. <laughs> Next year we have to come back with the baby. Yeah. Absolutely. Haskins was amazing. I am definitely going back there next year. It's so good. And me and Laura did say we're going to go back in January for like the sales because it is quite pricey in there. But we were in there for a few hours. Bearing in mind, we were like chatting each other's ear off um, over some food. But it was so good. Um, I'm so glad that's my first garden centre experience at Christmas time. It was bloody magical. It's got me really, really cheery. Uh, me and Sean are heading to London um, next weekend for the full weekend, which will be lovely. We're doing like loads of Christmassy stuff we're staying in Covent Garden because apparently they've got like fake snow every day in Covent Garden which I cannot wait for and um, so of course I'm gonna vlog I got a few little bits in there but I don't think I'm gonna be able to show you this evening because I'm gonna see my mum tonight for some dinner so I will probably jump back on tomorrow I will touch base with you guys tomorrow in a haul oh are you coming up as well ow Jesus pep
be a little bit more gentler with those paws of yours. We've got to show them what we got, didn't we? Hi guys, I am so sorry. I totally forgot that I said that I was gonna do a haul with you guys. Actually a few days later now. I've just woke up to excuse the hair and the no makeup look, I'm sorry. I didn't get loads in the garden center because as I said, it's not the cheapest place to buy things. Um, so one of the first items I got was two pack of charity cards and you get six cards in each pack. The reason I've gone for cards with dogs on is because these are specifically for my clients. The next item I got, which I actually got two of each, um, which I didn't think was a too bad a deal. They had four of these for £10 and they had lager and ale. Um, and the reason why I specifically got these because I found them to be very Christmassy, very festive. So they had the Polar Bar Premium Lager, which as you can see has a very festive label on it. And I also got two of the Stocking Filler Light Hoppy Ale, which again, I just really love the um, the label on it. We've got a Santa there and some sexy stockings, which is lovely. It's a nice little stocking filler for it to be like a little bit more festive and Christmassy. So yeah, really happy with that. And then I got four baubles for the Christmas tree. This one was 4 dollars Like I said, I know they're not cheap. And it's a white bauble that has this like gold speckled little tree and kind of cluster on there. I like to go for a bit of sparkle on my baubles because I feel like with the Christmas tree lights, when they really catch the light, it really, really sparkles and just looks really pretty. Another one I got that doesn't have any sparkle on, but it does have a bit of a bit of jazz on. Again, 4 dollars a gold pattern on like that, which I really, really like. And then the next two are quite gold orientated ones. It's funny because when we were in there, we were trying to remember what themed Christmas tree we had. And I was like, I don't know if mine's silver or if it's like gold or if it's rose gold. I couldn't really remember. So I've kind of gone for white and gold and the garden center so i'm hoping these will look all right again this one's 4.99 and like i say it's a gold color and it's got the cluster all the way around which is really really pretty and then this one was 2.99 they're all plastic which is great because i don't like having glass when i've got a dog but this was 2.99 and again it's a gold themed i don't know if you can see but it's got like the little gold leaves all the way around but it's actually got and if you can see that, a little bit of stuff inside to shake. So again, it's just got an extra bit of glitter inside to catch the light. But that is all I got. I could have bought way more. So that's going to finish today's video, guys. I hope you've all enjoyed today's vlog. Like I said, I really wanted it to be like a festive um, Christmassy dream. I hope it's all got you in the mood. Like I said, I'm so sorry for coming on here looking like this, but we're all friends here. And yeah, I hope you guys are all excited for Christmas. Let me know in the comments below what you've all got planned. Um, what you're thinking about doing for New Year's Eve. Um, let me know. I would love to hear what you're all getting up to. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Bye.